finish testing the Bennington Q25. Now this is the outboard version, and it's powered by Evinrude's new G2, which stands for Generation 2 300 horsepower E-Tech. This thing's crazy. It's all angular, different colors. It, in fact, we have the Hero package on this one, where they actually give you your own custom color. And what I love about it, it has this, when you hammer the throttle, it's got that really familiar two-stroke Evinrude sound, but it's a little, a little bit different. And man, is it furious. We got on plane in 2.6 seconds to 30 miles an hour in 6.7 seconds with a top speed of 45 miles an hour, cranking out 6,000 RPMs. And it sounds fast and it is fast. Well, Amanda, you don't often see this uh, with the boat and engine. You have a perfect match here. That wasn't by accident, I'm guessing. No, it's not. We actually partnered with um, <clears throat> Evinrude, and this is their Hero package exclusive for Bennington. It's our Matador Red. Um, so, yeah, it's color matched to the boat. Um, it's the exact paint color. So Beautiful. So it looks really nice. Well, Amanda, it looks like we're just missing one critical element here. Where's my drink? Yeah, you're right. This is set up uh, for entertaining, and it actually seats four. The captain's chair swivels around. Um, actually, you have his and her seating at the helm, which is a new feature for us, too. So um, those chairs swivel around to utilize the dinette table, and then the two of the aft chairs, the two aft chairs um, swivel stern, so you can actually sit in a stern lounge posture to watch water sports or just relax. That's cool. I don't think I've ever seen four uh, captain's chairs all around the table amidships like this is really neat. Yes, uh, engineering definitely had their hands full because that was one of the uh, demands, I suppose, from um, consumers and what we wanted to, pr to offer. So. Well, it looks like we have a nice uh, food prep area here too. Yes, too. lots of counter space at the galley and then you have a nice sink and there's actually a wine rack that holds three wine bottles back there. Nice, definitely ready for entertaining. Yes. Let's take a look at the helm. Amanda, this is a really futuristic looking helm. Uh, tell me what we have going on here. We call this our next generation council. It's um, definitely aesthetically very nice to look at and um, it has a comfortable footrest so you're in a nice recumbent posture like you would be in an SUV. Um, and then just the styling in general is obviously very appealing. Um, this is our matte maple wood trim and uh, the ivory interior here looks great with that. So. Um, new for this year, we have backlit aluminum gauges. Um, those are nice. And the Bluetooth stereo is standard for 2015, so that's nice. a nice feature. Looks like we have some great relaxing area up here. Let's take a look. Well, Amanda, you know the captain's chairs have pretty good back there, but this is pretty nice too. Yes, the diamond pillow top interior um, makes the bow seating look great, feel great. It's wonderful to use and you have uh, two wide berth chaise lounges um, up here and storage underneath all of the bench seating. And then the in-floor storage is not optional, but it's on this boat as well. Nice place to stow your skis, I imagine? Yeah, it, there's a lot of room down there. You can put uh, several sets of skis. Nice. For more information on the Bennington Q25 and other great boats, Go to BoatingWorld.com. I'm Alan Jones, and we'll see you out on the water.